How do you create a page like sponsored story targeted at your email list with Power Editor? We'll tackle that question in this week's video blog. Let's do it. All right, this week's question comes from Vanessa Lewis. Vanessa asks, would love a step-by-step -step video on how best to create a page post likes ad optimized for mobiles and desktop using custom audiences and how to create those based on the likes of similar audiences on Power Editor, John. Winky face. First of all, Vanessa, love it that you say, how do you do this in Power Editor? You're figuring it out, people. You need to use Power Editor. There's really no better way to create ads I love it when you guys are thinking this way. All right, so it's a pretty complicated question, but I'm gonna tackle this thing step by step. Let's do it. So the first thing we're gonna do is create a custom audience. So click on audiences within Power Editor, click create audience, and then custom audience. Name your audience, provide a description for your own use. And then you're gonna upload a CSV or text file of your email list. Make sure it's all in one column and all email addresses are valid. When you're done, just click Create. Once you click Create, you'll get this message that will take up to an hour for this targeting to be available. In the meantime, as you'll see, it'll say Waiting, and you'll get a whole lot of nothing here for the size of that audience. Typically, anywhere from 30 to 50%, sometimes less, sometimes more, those email addresses will be matched up to Facebook accounts. Now, while we're here, part of that question referred to creating audiences similar to those on your email list. We could do that with lookalike audiences. So click on your audience once it's created. So I'll do a whole different one here. Click create similar audience. You can only pick one country at a time. I'm going to do United States. You can do it either by similarity. So that's the top 1% of users similar to those on your email list or greater reach. That's the top 5%. For now, I'm just going to do similarity. So there you go, that's generated, and once again, it's gonna take up to an hour to populate that. So now let's create our campaign. Click Create Campaign, go ahead and name it. Set a daily or lifetime budget. Click that campaign name, click Ads, click Create Ad. Name that ad. This will be for a Facebook page. Select your page name, create the headline, add some text. You would normally pick an image here, but we're not worried about all that right now. Of course, if you wanted to be only in the news feed, click news feed, desktop, and mobile. And you could also choose which particular devices you want to target via mobile. So all mobile, feature phones only, Android devices only, iOS devices only. You could even get into specific devices with the minimum version. Go into advanced options for audiences, and you would type in your audience. Since I'm still waiting for my audience, I'm just going to pick a different one. And if you want to target people similar to that list, you would also add your lookalike audience. So here's one there. I love that I got this question about Power Editor today. I'm actually in the process of putting the finishing touches on a new training course completely around Power Editor. I've been hearing loud and clear from you all that you'd love to use Power Editor, but you just can't get your hands around it. So stay tuned for that. Now I gotta say, there were a ton of great questions this week and normally I wouldn't answer them, but I just don't think that's fair. So make sure you check out my blog post and answer several other questions there as well. Thanks again, Vanessa, for your question. I hope you found my answer helpful. Until next time, do awesome things. I'm out. All right, this week's question comes from Vanessa Willett. Oh no. You think anyone knows I'm wearing camouflage shorts and flip flops right now? Can you hear my flip-flops? That's professional right there, my friends.